Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video and in this video I'll be showing you how to install MIUI 9 drone for OnePlus 3 and OnePlus 3T devices. So guys finally you have MIUI ROM available for this device and few bugs are there in this but if you guys want to give a new look to your device you can go ahead and try this ROM and I'll also be telling you what are the bugs in this and how to install this ROM. It's pretty simple. So first we'll take a look at the settings. So we go to settings and in this you won't find about phone option available here instead you will have an my device option available at the top of the settings. So in this you have CPU what type of CPU you are using battery capacity rear camera screen size resolution and Android version. So all these things will be available at the top of the settings. So now let's go to home screen and so first you will notice all the icons are changed I am using the latest theme which was released along with MIUI 9 so you can see all the icons have pretty different look and it looks pretty awesome here so on home screen you have lots of options available here so if you pinch in here you get a settings of wallpaper widgets and settings of the home screen so in wallpapers you get few options to select wallpapers after that you have widgets and there's lots of widgets available here to place it on your home screen after that if you go to settings here you have transition effects you can change according to your requirement you can use side tumble or page option so few options available in transition effects after that you have autofill lock screen to enable this lock screen then you won't be able to move the icons from here it says home screen layout is locked so you won't be able to place the icon to different screen so after that you have more options available in this in this you have turn on quick card fill empty cells lock home screen layout show memory status so in this one more good option you have is if you want to change or place the icons to different home screen you can directly select as many as you want to place it on the other home screen and after that you just have to drag them and place it on the other screen so this is pretty good thing now you don't have to wait and do it one by one all together you can select all the icons and place it on the different home screen so in miui 9 uh, they also introduce split screen option here so if you press recents you get an option of screen uh, split screen mode in which you can just tap this and drag the application which you want to use in so here you will get a message on the screen which app does not support so which all apps supports this they can be easily accessible here and if those apps which are not getting supported you will get a message like the app doesn't support split screen so next moving on to smart assistant so they have also introduced this smart assistant feature in this in which you get lots of cards available here like calendar book a trip step counter this is similar to shelf which is available on oneplus devices having oxygen os running so they already have this option so this can be accessed the same way like if swipe towards your left on the home screen you can access smart assistant and one more thing which I like on this MIUI 9 is if you swipe up you get an option to search here and if you search anything over here like I'll just search Google and it will entirely search your device it won't be searching specific app or anything uh, which is specific to web search it will completely search your device if you have any kind of contacts or anything it will entirely search your device and quick switch is also available in this room so if you are using any app like this you just double tap and you go back to the app which you previously used so guys as of now i won't be doing a complete review because uh, it cannot be used as daily driver and it has few bugs available in this so bugs like camera doesn't work so if you open camera you get an error over here i also tried with different camera that is open camera that also says fail to open camera so camera as of now is not working and one more thing which is not working is sounds so in this you can see i have already enabled vibration mode i'll just disable this and if you try to decrease or increase volume sound doesn't work on this so this is a bug which I have been noticing but you can if you guys want to use you can still use it in vibration mode and give a try if you like the room because I feel it's pretty good and hope they fix this sound and camera issue in upcoming update 
so these are the things which i feel are good in this room so now i'll also show you how to install this room for that guys make sure your device has twrp recovery installed and also download the files which i have mentioned in the description below for both the devices oneplus 3 and oneplus 3d so oneplus 3 this is my oneplus 3 which i am using and for oneplus 3 what you have to do is you need to download two uh, files that is miui 9 oppo 3 and the, this is the second file 3t23 so this file if you don't flash the device won't boot up so for the installation process um, just follow the video and do not skip any step or else you may have boot loops so guys let's boot a device to twrp recovery first so once a device boots to twrp recovery guys make sure to change system file so first what you need to do is you need to go to wipe advance and from here you need to change click on data and click on repair or change system file so after this is done you need to change file system and select ext4 so guys this is mandatory or else your device won't boot up later you can change to f2fs that's not an issue but to boot up your phone it should be ext4 so what i do is i select this and swipe to change so once it is done i go back go to install here your internal memory will be completely deleted so make sure to make a backup of that and after that connect your device to your pc and place those files so i have placed both the files inside it so first is the main rom file and after that is 3t23 so this is only required for uh, oneplus 3 if you guys have oneplus 3t then download the main zip file and flash that so there this file won't be required the first one so what i do is i select this confirm to flash so once this is done go back and flash this file and after that hit reboot system so now you can see the system boots up and if you guys face any kind of twrp recovery password issue then just reboot to recovery and just do a normal wipe so now complete the initial setup so in this you have english language also you can skip this so guys for this make sure you don't connect your wi-fi before completing the initial setup once you complete the initial setup then you can connect to wi-fi so after you complete your initial setup you can connect your sim card or you can connect your wi-fi so i am using volt sim card uh, geo sim card which supports volt and what i do is now i'll try to install google applications to install google application make sure guys you have google installer version 2 and not below that and not above that because online you'll find one more google uh, version 4.4 something is that so don't flash that also so now i have connected my device to wi-fi and now what i'll do is i'll again go back to file manager and install google installer version 2.0 after this you'll be able to access your google account just hit install and follow the steps so now the process completes i go back i add my google account and i'll show you all the contacts everything is available there is no issue with this so you can just give a try i'll show you guys after using my google account in this i've added my google account in this so i'll see whether any application has to be updated will update them so google i'll just update this application and meanwhile i'll go and show you whether contacts are available or not so you can see all my contacts are available in this so there is no issue with the contacts only issue what i have seen is the camera and the sound problem with this room so that's all in this video guys if you like the video do give me a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel do not forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching have a great day